Now, Zach, I want to talk to you about this. I find this hugely exciting. Yeah. You have recently started dating yeah. someone. Yeah. How's that going? It's fun. How did you meet? Well, OK, so um, <laughs> she, the, she writes a sex and relationship column that I've read for years and always liked it. Like, it's really warm and thoughtful and funny, and I always wanted to meet her. So I sent her, a, like, a real creeper email. <laughs> where I was just like, hey, I love your column. Want to get a drink? <laughs> and she wrote back, and she's like, that's creepy, but OK. And um, I was so nervous, because I was, I, I was like starstruck, because I was like such a fan of her work. And we sat down, and we got a drink. And like one of the first things she said was, um, my friends say, we were talking about like types. Yeah. And she's like, my friends say my type is guys who look like a dying bird. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. <laughs> And then I calmed down, and the rest of the day was really good, yeah. I got to say, I think I would find it pretty intimidating to date a sex and relationship <laughs> columnist. Yeah, I said if she writes about me in her column to use a fake name and call me Bruno. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would say you probably, you, you want to probably make every night, like, the Super Bowl. <laughs> And don't, don't ever phone it in, because you know that your worst night will be the night if, God forbid, you guys ever break up, that'll be what she writes about. Yeah. Yeah. Uninspired. Yeah, her next comma will be like, how to have reasonably adequate <laughs> sex. <laughs> <laughs> Stick around, we'll be these three when we come back.